Hi, welcome back to my video. In this video, you are going to learn how to check the victim's WMIC status using the meterpreter shell command. So what is WMIC? WMIC is a Windows Management Instrumental Command Line. When you get the meterpreter of an victim PC, then you can enumerate the information of an victim and make changes using the WMIC command. And now, here I am already in the shell command. If you want to open the shell command, after getting the meterpreter command, just type shell. So before moving further to WMIC command, we will just get the information by typing WMIC slash question mark. Here is the information and the options present in the Windows Management Instrumentation command line. This shows that the following options are globally switches. If you type system info in the meterpreter command, you will only get the few information of an victim PC. What if you can get the more information in depth? So for that, here I am typing WMIC computer system get name domain model username roles slash format list. So what this command stands for? Here the name gets the PC name, model gets the model information. I have kept the roles as the format list because so I want to get the, all the information in the list format. For that I have type format is to list. So now here you can see the information about the victim device that too in the listed format. Moving to the next command that is SIDS server ID or security identifier. For this command, I am going to type WMSC group get caption install date local account domain SID status. So here you can see the SID information. You can see the captions install date local account and domain at a status. And then moving to the next command, think of what if you can get the biomass serial number of the victim device. For that you should need to type WMIC BIOS get serial number. Then pressing enter, different users have the different serial number. So here I got the victim PC serial number. It shows only half but for you it may show fully. Then moving to the next command. What if you can lock the details of the user account management? So for that you should need to type WMIC user account where name equal to sack. It's an username and set disable equal to false. Then press enter. Okay here you can see the user account has been locked. It shows that it has updated successfully. It may work for some PCs, it may not. Moving to the next command, renaming the user account. For that, you should need to type WMIC username where name equal to SAC and I am renaming as SAC Hacken. So here you can see that the renaming a local user, the output shows that it has been executed successfully. Like this, there are many commands present in the WMIC I have given in the description. We can try them. That's all this video. Thank you.